Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Ahana and this is Bozo. I'm sure you guys are wondering why he looks so different. And this is because today he went and got a haircut. <gasps> Yay! Oh, So there was a lot of hair going into his eyes and like um, there was so much hair over his body and on his stomach. So we scheduled an appointment to get him a haircut and it took about two hours. He took a shower, he got a blueberry facial and he looks so good now. And he smells good because they add a little bit of puppy cologne on them after they're done. Oh, say hello to everyone, Bozo. Hello. So this morning for breakfast, my mom made garlic bread in the air fryer. And that got me thinking, why don't we make something quick, healthy and tasty for these two in the air fryer? So um, I know a lot of you guys are working and super busy with them. So like this is very useful because it's quick, it's healthy and it's super tasty for them. And I'm sure your puppies are gonna enjoy. But before we start making, please make sure to like and subscribe. Are you done? Okay, let's get started. So for this quick and healthy recipe, you need chicken. Well, I'm using chicken because Ollie and Bozo love chicken the most, but feel free to use any other type of meat like um, lamb, pork, turkey, beef, anything that your puppy likes. And I'm using grated baby carrots, one bowl. Oh, Bozo's waiting for his food. Oh. Just a little bit longer. And um, your puppies need grains, I mean greens. So uh, we tried using broccoli, but that ended up tasting kind of weird. So spinach is a really good option instead of broccoli. Okay, and uh, after you're done, you should use two sprays of olive oil, just two sprays. Okay, now let's get started. First, make sure to wash your hands because I'm gonna be using my hands to mix it all together. And first, you're gonna add your chicken or any type of meat that you're using. Oh, now the baby carrots. The spinach. Ooh, it's so colorful. Okay, and now Mix well. It smells so good and it looks delicious. Okay, I think it's all properly mixed now. So I'm gonna try making it into like a circular or any flat shape. I'm gonna try and see which one turns out the best. I'm gonna roll it in my hands. Not too big because they're just small puppies. Flatten it out a little. And I already sprayed uh, this surface with the olive oil. You can see they're all perfectly rolled and flattened out and placed on the surface. So now I'm going to put this in the air fryer. Okay. And we're going to cook this for 10 minutes on 380 degrees. 
No, 370 degrees actually. Okay, 10 minutes start. Okay, so now it's cooking and I'll see you guys in 10 minutes. Oh, Bozo, you're still waiting? Just 10 more minutes. And then you can eat. Okay, so the timer just went off. And, oh wow, look at this. Mm, it smells amazing. Okay, now, uh, hold on, I need to get a big spoon to put it on the plate. Okay. Let's put them on the plate. Oh, and look, even Ollie came. Ollie, are you hungry? Okay, hold on, I'm leaving. You have to wait for it to cool down. The shape is so good. And there's eight of them, so Bozo gets four and Ollie gets four. Feed them to Ollie and Bozo. So now I mash them all up and now they're all cold enough for them to eat. <gasps> it's dinner time! Wow! Okay, go back, go back. Start eating. Is it tasty? Wow, Bozo really loves it. Ollie's a bit of a slow eater, but that's okay. I think he really likes it. Slow down, Bozo. You're going too fast. So while Ollie and Bozo are eating, I just want to remind you guys again that I made this recipe uh, for 10 minutes and on 370 degrees. And if you haven't seen my other two videos, this one is where I made a homemade chicken recipe and this one is when I made a healthy homemade vegetarian recipe. And since you guys know, it's summer, which means it's super hot and all the imbos will go on walks every day. So they feel super hot and when they come back in, um, we have some popsicle treats for them. So please make sure to watch this video to see how we made those. Okay, and please make sure to like and subscribe. Bye!